Egypt, a land once home to a great civilization, whose secrets are still being uncovered 3,000 years later. One of the greatest mysteries surrounds the reign of Egypt's most powerful pharaoh. A thousand years after the building of the pyramids, and 50 years after the reign of King Tutankhamun, Ramesses the Great took the throne of Egypt. He would become Egypt's greatest pharaoh, reigning for nearly 70 years and bringing stability and prosperity to the land. Dr. Chris Naunton has come to one of Egypt's most spectacular ruins, a magnificent temple built to honor the great king's memory. Well, this is the funerary temple of Ramesses II on the west bank of the Nile in Luxor. It's absolutely enormous, and it's a testimony to Ramesses' power as a great builder and to his ambition to leave a legacy that would last for all eternity. The scale is magnificent. These statues are enormous. The temple itself is enormous. But it's not just the size of the monuments that he left us, it's their number as well. We have more monuments belonging to Ramesses II than of any other pharaoh. It's easy to see, perhaps, why we know him as Ramesses the Great. From 1279 BC, Ramesses oversaw the biggest building program in Egypt since the time of the pyramids. And throughout the land, on every temple and statue, Masons carved his cartouche, the set of hieroglyphs that form his royal name. You see this very distinctive oval-shaped ring surrounding a series of hieroglyphs. And we read this all together as Ramesses, beloved of the god Ammon. <laughs> 